All right, everybody. I think this time I'm going to remove my camera from here. Guys, welcome, welcome. Sorry for the delay. We're just getting started up. All right, we're going to get you live with the bracket in just a moment. Christian or didn't sign up. Jesus. These guys are tryharding and Chicago of the walk, but that's good. They're Chicken Man does a lot of them. All right, guys. And guys, if you could help out, please use the Raid Shadow Legends thing. I can't believe I'm that guy, but you know what? We got 15 out of 20 people. If we get 20 people, it's going to add $160 to... Uh, that'll bring us up to three hundred twenty dollars of the goal. I have that going for a few days. I'll be doing some more of it after. Try to get some more. Uh, it's really going to help out for StarCraft tournaments. And I have a goal of if we. I want to get all the codes used. I have a goal to do like a fifteen hundred dollar tournament. Down the right road, top thirty two payout. Uh, that'll be not like in a hurry, but I. Uh, you know that's the one where I want some bigger casters with me. Loco Nathanius. Some ones that we don't normally get, you know. Baalmulf steadfast too big time. I'm not even listed. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh dead Mac. Oh, you're funny. Old Slippy Boy will be there. Alright, I'm gonna go make the bracket live. The players have been waiting too long. Sorry to whoever couldn't make it. I reached out to a lot of people. Oh, Xiao Mac didn't say I got a message, Xiao Mac. Who that was, man? All right, we're going live. Fuck it. And we are live. Yeah, we're going to go.
Maybe next time they'll done. Yeah, exactly. Uh, the thing is, is next time I'm gonna I'm gonna do different times for my tournaments because, to be honest, we had so many stacked players. It's hard for the Korean players. It's hard for the EU players. It's, it's hard for. We don't really get that many NA players lately. Neeb, uh, Neeb must be busy with school now or starting up. I try, I was hoping Neeb would play, but uh, I was really hoping Solar would today. But and me and Micah had to bail. He told me, you know, it's just. It's too late for him. He already he played two tournaments today already. And Bion reminded me of GSL tomorrow, so. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Wait. All right, let's see. I'm gonna get Gref. Fuck is this music? Wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna go to EU. Let's hope I can get him. We're gonna do Gref versus Game Front Germany. Because why not? We're going to change it up. We had a lot of people not go in, but you know, we had a lot of people sign up at least, so that's that's really good. <laughs> it's just that I'll be honest, it's the shitty times. I'm not going to cater to whatever after. It gets hard for this shit, for planning the times, like, truthfully. I just do you do it when you can do it. Gamer Richie, what up, dude? Do you want to cast? Wait. All right, we got Gamer Richie coming in with me. I love you. Wait, 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 wait. Yo, Farrell donated ten dollars. Well donated ten dollars. Pizza money, my boomer brother. Barrel. Thank you. Okay. It's channel. <laughs> no, thank you so much. But Game of Richie, I'm. <laughs> Uh, any coverage is welcome of these tournaments. All right, sorry guys. Let's get this show on the road. A gamer Richie.
Thank you so much again, Feral, by the way. All right, let's go. <laughs> All right, guys, we got our first game. Gamer Richie's going to be joining me after. The man, the myth, Mr. Stim to win. Uh, Chicken man will be. All right, let's see. And we are going to go on to game number one. Spawning in the bottom right hand corner of Data CD's Nuts. With the Peep Mode logo from Peeps. <laughs> it is Game Front Germany. Big fan of the Peep Mode. And his opponent in the bottom left representing Astra. It is Gref, our blue Protoss player, who is presumably going for a cannon rush. Mr. Gref is known for his cannon rushing. Bear with me, guys. We're just getting started here. And Dan Mako, absolutely. Guys, use those fucking raid Shadow Legend codes, please, for the love of God. I want to use L40 or whatever in the next seven days so we can get $640 toward a $1,500 tournament down the pike a little bit. Uh, and honestly, we're going to open that up to a lot of casters, whatever. You know? Uh, cause that's gonna bring a lot of players who lag. Oh my gosh, dude. Dennis, hang on, guys. Let me see what's going on here. Had a bit of a problem. Graf Cannon rushing a Terran. How base is that? We are. This is going to be a funny one. Honestly, not a horrible response considering Game Front Germany is probably not expecting this. Except he should probably lift. Yeah, that graph's going to be in an okay position. He should have. Okay, he needs to pull SCVs right now. Like, this is not going to take care of it. And he's not going to be able to get that back one, but he should have lifted the barracks just before this. Like, you got to pull stuff back. He's getting gas. So he could potentially drop a factory, but a lot's going to rely. Yeah, he's not going to get the damage done he needs to. He's going to get the probe. So, okay, now we need... To, yeah, he shouldn't start pulling the workers, but... It's too little too late. I think this is going to be a, a pretty quick one, folks. Game Front Germany trying to go for... Oh, GG. And Gref cheeses his way to victory in game number one. Uh, also, I'm going to adjust the raid thing. Now, if I seem grumpy, it's because I am. I'm old. Gamer Richie will, will be joining me after, and uh, Chicken Man will be hopping into this. Figured we'd change up the start of this. We've already given Mr. Jip enough coverage. Now we can say Acheron's busy. So, guys, a shout out to Gamer Richie. Will be joining me, and uh, he's gonna be covering another side.
All right. We can wait for Richie. I'm getting Richie in here. Hey, how you doing, Gamer Richie? I know it's tiring for you. And welcome everybody in chat. Gamer Richie's with me. How was the rest of the tournament with Mr. Farrell there? Yeah, yeah. Trigger in chat was just mesmerized by cannon rush we just had. Gref just uh, took the game in two minutes and 30 seconds. <laughs> Against the Terra, nonetheless. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, and we're on EU right now for this one, by the way. Am I, I mentioned, or am I so safe that you shit, just Dan blew Mackle, your thank mind? You for the 20 J. Dubia, 181, just subscribed. What a fucking legend. Donating. Am I? This is the guy that so donated $125 that to the mind. tournament. B -I -M -M -E -L -B -U -R -G -E -R -S -C -H -L -O -E -B -B -S -E. and now gifting 20 subs. What a madman. -E -E just subscribed. Am I? Or am I so I safe heart, right? that you just blew your mind? Colin yeah. underscore South Carolina 2 just subscribed. Am uh, I? Or am I so sad no, that you just you. blew well, we your mind? You in, gamer Richie. CSO underscore Mozzie just subscribed. Am I? Or am I so sad that you just blew your mind? Shiki just subscribed. Yeah, absolutely. Am I? Or am I so sane that you just blew you your mind? Mateo underscore SC2 now. just subscribed. Am I? Or am I so um, sane that you just blew to your mind? The sign up, we have Firewind 22 out of the 34. So we have uh, Geralt if he finishes his game series with Christiana and the Cock of the Walk. Or am I so sane uh, that you just blew your Nicarac, mind? Bio Ice, Trigger, Drum Drum Mina, just Paco subscribed. Mike. Uh, Kozan, uh, baby. Am I? Or am baby I so Marine? sane oh, that you what just we blew can your mind? Max Holdisk okay. 2 just subscribed. <laughs> am I? Or am I yeah. so sane that you just blew your mind? Yeah, I'm Argyle sorry. There's so many sounds going on that I can't even think. I apologize, Richie. But yeah, are you pretty stoked we am got... I? Or am I we so got a, still a stack that you tournament. just blew we your mind? We had Micah interested. I flowed just subscribed. Um, Skillis was interested, but it got a little too late for some people. Goblin, Cuckoo. Am Unfortunately, I? those guys couldn't make it. Or am I so it. sane but that you just blew right? your mind? Old Man Toast just subscribed. Yeah, and absolutely. Uh, that said, do you want to do the honors? It's a Terran. <laughs> and his opponent in the bottom right representing Ast uh, Astra. It is Gref in the blue. Mr. Cannon Rusher, man. Going for it again. <laughs> nah, he's going for it. Gre Gref is like the European probe scout Samuel. I would say the British, be the British probe scout Samuel is the original. Would be Grimmy, of course. You know, the UK cannon Russia.
Really? He was? <laughs> Lord Grimmy. Based? I love Grimmy. I actually shot him a message because I hadn't seen him in so long. Uh, what a nice guy, though. I know he's, you're like, God, fil usually people like filthy cannon rushers, but Grimmy's such a... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is great. Look at the yeah, two SCVs caught in the line of fire. Yeah. The Marine falls the Richie. I don't know how much I like that tech lab coming out of the factory or reactor. Yeah, he needs to repair this bunker, and he could potentially take out that one. I'm with you, Richie. This is close. I mean, yeah, he's going to have a third, but if he gets that one cannon, that's one less thing to hurt him. Oh, he gets one in him. Okay. Yeah. This is just absolutely, you know, I would be molding right now if I was in uh, Game Front Germany's position. This is, I know you would be, <laughs> you're like. You, you know, that's a. Uh, I don't like this out of that supply depot being built there though. Like I know he's walling, but like he doesn't really need it And that's potentially just gonna go down the SCB or it will just from the probe or adept going in there. Oh Shit, that's huge. That is so big It is gonna finish here in a second when this back pylon finishes but uh, truthfully, I would have rather, it sounds crazy, after he should have immediately been targeting the uh, backwards, ca that cannon in the back, because it was pr it's pretty damaged, in my opinion. I don't know if, uh, if you'd agree with me on that, but proper response with the Cyclone. Because you know, the cannon rusher, you know it's going to be a Void Ray, let's be honest here. <laughs> Absolutely. Farrell, we can get you in here too and have a trifecta cast. I don't care. We have Chicken Man coming in after. He's going to be covering stuff. I'm going to have to... We can even do like dual cast split up people. We usually do mu musical casters. We've done it before with Dale Mulf and Florencio. So if you're down for that too, so we can cover more stuff. Look at this. GG. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, and we're going to take a look, see what's going on here, going, so hopping over to... Uh, hopping over to NA, see what we can catch. Oh, Jesus, I have so many channels. Oh, my God, they're only... Okay. Oh, Jip versus Mac. Is that happening? Is Slip Jip playing Max Packs? You know Slip Jip, right? Or no? Yeah, it's going to be Slip Jip versus Max Packs. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> he got GM, by the way. Flippy. Flip it. Oh, yeah. Well, you're like, no shit, Dave. <laughs> Let's see if Feral wants in just in case, because I don't want to be. But I mean, you know, I know it's a little bit of a shit show. Yeah. Shout out to Rainer, by the way, for getting a hold of Baby Marine for me. I have Rainer's contact, but not Baby Marine. How about that? <laughs> yeah, is that nuts? I'm like, bro, get your brother in here. Because I knew Rainer wouldn't play in this one, you know. Yeah. Musical cast, yeah. Uh, basically, uh, let's get Farrell in here. Let's, let's, uh, oh, I gotta send friend Ed, me as a friend, Farrell. Let's get a group call. And what you do is basically, I'm gonna, uh, wait, 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 Max Pack started? Jesus, Max, remake. <laughs> We're doing slip chip versus max packs. We, those guys got not on them start without us. Yeah, I, I got I'm as DMing him, but we're we were just not friends in there. Gamer Rich. Okay, we're gonna make a new call. All right, let's go. Let's go. Hey, what up, Farrell? Yeah, my boomer brother indeed, and we got my my our younger brother. We bear with us. I'm gonna tell them. Gamer Richie and Farrell. Can you get on to NA quick? Uh so I just explained to Richie, if you want to, we could do musical casters. Uh like I was hoping to cover different lobbies. Richie streaming. If you anybody can stream, whatever. Chicken man's gonna be joining us after Cock of the Walk at some point. Uh, but musical casters usually is we have two uh, two of us and we'll cast a series and then we'll flip the next series when it when it's available to. So say it'd be like Game of Richie and Dave and then Chicken Man and Feral and then we switch it up in between and the next is, you know, we we bounce around and we did that with Bale Wolf, uh, Ch Chicken Man, Florencio and I before it was pretty funny. Uh, I, uh, this, is a, this is too much sex appeal here. I posted the lobby link. Are you... Are you... Uh, yeah, I did, Richie is. I guess I... Am I the New York meat in the sandwich, you know? <laughs> exactly. The New York, yeah. Uh, the channel is Dave Testa with no space. So slash join Dave Testa on NA for this one. Yeah, and Slip Chip's actually younger than Max Pax is the funny thing. So we have he was actually Grandmaster for his first time recently. Still hasn't hit puberty, but <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I did it. I did it. I did it first too. Like honestly, but then 
I realized he's a, you know, just a young kid when I first met him. But, all right, so you get in here for Max Pax is getting impatient. You know how I, these pro players get. Uh, he's, I apologize. Wait. You're drinking for me? I got a beer. Like, I know I'm supposed to be whatever, but I got a beer. I fucked up on my whole thing a bit here and there, and honestly, I'm doing fine with it. Nina somehow upset Veteran Gamer 2-0. Ooh, that sounds really good. I just got a warm-ass Bud Light, which tastes... That's actually disgusting. Yes. All right, let's see. Let's... Let's see if Mr. Farrell... Oh, I see you. Sorry, Farrell. I'm just going to invite you to game. Whenever you kids... Yeah. Yeah. Farrell, thanks for popping in and for the donation to it, that, but... Guys, if you want to, too, even just because of stuff, I like to get more coverage. So, like, in the f future, too, we can set up casters, whatever. Chicken Man and I usually meet up in the finals because it's, you know what I mean, from the old the old ritual of Chicken Man Testa. But truthfully, we've done everything. We've had, like, five casters in. <laughs> All right, so. All right. You know what? Who wants the honors? The big man Farrell or Gamer Richie? <laughs> Mr. Richie? <laughs> All right, this is going to be a spicy one. I told Ma Max Pax actually laughed when I said, you know, Slip Chip's actually younger than you. He, he, just, he actually was laughing. Uh, like, uh, I think he's like 17. Maybe he's approaching 18, I think. But, you know, Slip Chip's like 15. Uh... I know, yeah, Richie here look younger than us. Drink beer or two. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, we've got socks older than Richie, you know. <laughs> Farrell and I, yeah, cr crust. Cross. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That's actually kind of disturbing, but you know what? I'm not judging because I got some old underwear too. Uh, hey, best of, best of three. Uh, best of five finals. Oh yeah, I, I saw that. I was pretty cool. I'm stealing that. That's just like, you know, I, that was a five five head play. Let's be real here, greasy, but man, I'm just like, what is poor Demaga gonna do? I'll be honest, I, re I reached out to him too if he ever wants to cast these, if I have them in times. Like him in, in like a Ukrainian cast, and, and the same went to like Indy Starcraft, and you know, other, he's more than welcome to too, you know, other than play, cast, whatever, you know. We, Troll Jumi has done it before, you know.
<laughs> yeah, the Yeah. Max. Yeah. Like the game just started and it's basically over from two adapts. That's insane. <laughs> yeah, there's hope, but I mean. We do have uh, what appears to be four gate blink from Max Pack. So, and uh, to be honest, Slip Chips had his normal worker count. <laughs> Make you. <laughs> you like to see the Protoss probes go down, huh? Let's see if Slip Chip can get it done. Uh, Max Packs uh, doesn't have anything. It's wow. He's not postured at all in that position, actually. It, it's... We got Hopium, boys. Yeah. So close to getting him. God damn. Oh, uh, the tank wasn't sieged. Yeah, but he doesn't have a tank. Yeah, the one tank on the high ground is not quite there and just... Look at that micro though. Each stalker independently blinked in just the right amount. Oh God. Yeah, he's just not letting him. He's been in like every team. That was the best of three. Uh, no, sorry, I was getting it. I'm also admitting this too, so bear with me. Okay. Yeah, we first of all is already advanced to round three, the round of eight. By the way, uh, beating Enhimba, winner of Geralt and Kozan goes on. I think Kozan's being kind enough to wait for Geralt in the tryhard finals. Imagine tryharding in the fifty-dollar cock of the walk when we got this going on in the finals. Like those guys, I'm surprised they're not just like, all right, we're just teasing each game. You know what I mean? But it's 
Chicken Man's done so many cock of the walks, I don't blame him. And both Geralt and Christiana have been in them const you know, the staple. Or are you in, in, in okay, Feral is. You're going down max packs. Kappa. <laughs> Oh, sorry guys, I didn't mean to space out on you here. It's been a... I'm on goofy hours and all that. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. It was Dave versus Max Pax. I've got coaching from Max Patch, and it was basically like... The funny thing is, for, for the hour we did it, Max Pax like, yeah, we'll give you a little more time, whatever. Uh, it was basically like you... Gamer Richie was like you in chat when we were coaching, except for like mostly just him cringing at me trying to use units that I never use, like oracles. <laughs> Did you? Good for you. <laughs> yeah, I think, uh. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah, there you go. My man. Sure, I was just going into this, uh, spawning in the upper left-hand corner. A moon dance in the blue from Psystorm Gaming. Give it up for Max Pax. And either one of you. <laughs> Chicken man in the <laughs> Yeah you called. <laughs> uh, I just message. Yeah, that's uh, this is the Percival actually. If you remember Gamer Richie, you remember when he did this? This is big brain. I think this is the this is the way to go. I mean, if you're playing against a, a player of the caliber of Max Packs, I don't like the fact. That, well, he's of course not gonna have tech with how he's playing this, but I hope he gets a reactor or tech lab soon. Oh. Okay. Cancel the marine! <laughs> Cancel the damn marine slip chip! Yeah, two more, I mean... Why is he going for the factory if he just dropped the reactor? It should, I, it, I don't know if I'm, I'm wrong here, Richie, but I would have dropped the reactor. Oh. Yeah, he's like... Oh, God. It'd be, it, that's a good build. Yeah. And he's not... Technically, he's not, like, all in on this either. I mean, he's obviously... Oh, my God. Max Pack's going for DTs. It's like, you know what? 
I, I, but I mean, I, truthfully, the memes aside, I actually that's actually a, a really good response to this because what's Terran really gonna have to defend against DTs? You're gonna, you know, he's gonna have a couple orbitals, but presumably gonna be muling. <laughs> oh my god exactly but yeah and truthfully that is a brilliant hold uh, oh the dts are already out that's not a scan available gg slip chip nose oh hey that was a good effort and that was that was honestly All right, so we might want to do musical casters. We're gonna. No. Who is Zergomatic? Yep. Who looks like Nina? Wait, who's going on? As luck would have it, the two friendos, Nino and Trigger, are duking it out right now. But, but, Do not underestimate the yeah. power of the Dark Shrine. Uh, Trigger's actually maybe, I don't know if he was living there or if he was just visiting, but Trigger actually was just at Nina's place, which for the first time he actually has good internet. <laughs> like, I think that kid would, uh, people underrate it, but he has such rough internet that I think he, like, he would perform a lot better. A lot of... Yeah. Ooh, Gref. Uh, winner of Trigger and Nina goes on to play Gref. The cannon rusher. Yeah. Percival or Geralt? Uh, we've seen max packs go down to a lot of them. Han Mono has pulled some crazy stuff. Baby Marine was playing pretty crack right lately. Uh, Nick, yeah, honestly, Nicarac is, has beaten max packs a few times in these tournaments in like, like the Chicken Man Test Opens. Hey, Dave, where'd you learn this build from? Princeton University. Mm-hmm. 
who's always a lucky. Uh, honestly, Han Mono is really good, in my opinion, for a chair. Yeah, like, he's got a really cool, cheeky, cheesy style, but he's gotten damn lucky sometimes. Um, I would say overall, out of players that consistently do it, I've seen Mitchie Tommy take a game off Richie uh, Rattata. He's a Diamond 1 Zerg player, and he took a, a game off Rattata. Uh, and a Diamond 1. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> yeah. We'd get so wrecked. <laughs> we would get so wrecked. Chicken man's a diamond scrub like me, so you, you'd have the Richie carry. Yeah, so who's the caster duo? Yeah, yeah. No, I mean for the next one. I'm really gonna ask Chicken. Chicken Man is the OG premier caster, man, you know? Let's face it, he is. Because Chicken Man's been on a break for a while, but like, you know, he's back in it. But he's he's been casting ESL and everything for a long freaking time, you know? Uh... Nah, you're you're a fun guy, Farrell. You know what I'm saying? Like honestly, with these two, like it depends. Like I've been trying to work on my casting over time. I added Chicken Man to the call. Chicken Man! Oops. <laughs> Poor Chicken Man. He isn't expecting it. No, he, yeah, he's, uh, he just goes, oh. Hope you're on the other mic in Discord. I think I popped that on him. He accidentally clicked it. I think because he's engaging his chat and stuff. Look at this guy's setup, though. Chicken Man has, like, the, honestly, he has one of the best fucking... What's up, brother? And, uh... I'm gonna be trying to hit up everybody for the replays, Chicken Man, because this should be some good casting for any of us for stuff we're missing too and uh hmm? <laughs> so who won the cock of the walk by the way i'm oh, sorry the noise <laughs> Excellent. So yeah, I did uh Chicken Man Gamer Richie's former 6K Terran from the EU is getting back in. And uh Farrell's the owner of Berserker Esports, who you may know or not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's, this is perfect timing. We got the king cock here. We have the fer we have feral gasms. Yeah, you know, and we have Dave testicles. Oh, geez. Would be nice if we could get some lobbies going. And uh, 
Ticket man, didn't mean to throw this on. You know how it goes, though, sometimes. Usually we were doing this before, but this kind of spontaneously happened. Which, you know, sometimes could be for better or worse, but figured we'd have some uh, UK folks to class us up a little bit, you know? Or declass us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness all right let's yeah, let's, let's see what's going on here so Geralt and Kozan's going on I think Nick Racton. so a lot of these are on EU too so I mean well Yeah, some of them. Uh, yeah, Bio Ice and Paco Mike. Yeah. I'm going to update the score, too. Yo, my boy Slipjip got bodied by Max Pax, but you know what? He, he actually... He, he did something really good, Chicken Man. You'd be proud. If you... <laughs> Hang on, I think I got us a lobby. I'm trying to catch us. Um, that's awesome. Do you want a quadcast or split it up like I was saying and we can flop them around? I'm trying to get a hold of Nina. Oh, you got it. Are we just all doing it? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, shit. Wait. Okay, hang on. We're trying. Okay. All right, hang on. Hang on, hang on. I'm going to put it in the Dave Testa channel. That they they just So what do you want to do? We splitting calls? We splitting calls for chaos or, or are we just going with it? You're not worried? How about Chicken Man and uh, Chicken Man and Game Richie's intros first, huh? Or <laughs> I don't know the score, by the way. Shit. So speaker? Oh, <laughs> the on the left side? Oh, it looks like it's a subwoofer, yeah, on the right. It's, it's a, I think it's just the decal, but that does kind of look like a subwoofer now that you say that.
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, oh, who wants to have some fun? Absolutely, we're going to have the Stargate versus Stargate, which usually is the result of this little scuff if it goes that way, but that trigger's going to finish a little quicker. But why... okay. Why is Nina not building a... Phoenix? Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, shield battery for one adept. That's not going <laughs> to matter too much. Uh, and nice. Oh, we need a micro in. Yeah, the Oracle seems to be able to get some kills because the shield battery was drained from that one adept. <laughs> That's all I got to say. Yeah. 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 Oh! And she just lost an oracle, and it looks like another one. Literally, if it's still what I think it is, unless Trigger went back home. If it's the case, Trigger's computer's right next to Nina's. Because uh, they Trigger's been crashing with Nina. So, they, they've been getting a lot of PvP practice in, to say the least. So, this should be uh, 
pretty interesting. <laughs> As Nina said, triggers her PvP coach. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I would have liked it if Nina proxied that Dark Shrine. She has the proxy pylon. Uh, when you're against Stargate, obviously that's a daring move, but I think that would have been Nina's best shot as a quick comeback to get some worker damage or, you know, depower some pylons, whatever she could get. But uh, unfortunately, like you said, it's scouted and uh, consequently, I don't think uh, Nina has any detection at the moment. Would just like the. Well, look at that body block. Nina's. Yeah, Nina's. I'll be honest with you guys. Oof. Uh, Nina was trying to buy time as much as she could, and that was a tough call to make because she figured she could body block it. And that's a tough call to make because see, the observer even came out just after. I think that was her play was let's hope we can body block a DT and and maybe get a force field in if we can trap both, but she just wasn't lucky enough. Chicken man's got chicken man's got the answer to this one. I think. What are, what are you thinking, chicken man? She got a shot. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that was actually not too bad of a shot, at least on the immortal. Not too bad. the tough th easier said than done though uh with the level of micro of trigger and you know both of them it's easier said than done oh ho, ho. <laughs> that stasis ward game has been sick for mina Yeah. 
Uh, they're pretty close. And do you guys mind if we would, can we start this splitting up a casters? Just because everything's great, but I think we're we're a smidge crowded. But it could be that I'm just old and tired. And then we can just bounce around. If that's cool, is that fair, Chicken Man, Feral, Richie agrees. All right, thanks. See you soon, yeah. And we can, yeah, we can change it up, whatever. It's fine. Chicken Man and I can go on for now. That's cool. Uh, we'll bounce. Um. Oh, Richie's calling you. <laughs> All right, cool. See ya. I guess we'll just stay here. <laughs> What? That would be Gerald Percival. I'm sure Richie's probably gonna whatever we want. Uh, actually, I mean it's up to you if we catch whatever one. I'm sure Richie's gonna want Percival, but honestly, Jerk, I'm gonna give it to you. Yeah. I, honestly, if you ever want somebody in, he's getting into this full time. I don't, I'm sure you notice he's a little bit of a dominant caster at times, but Richie's very knowledgeable of Terran. You know what I'm saying? Uh, somebody, I would definitely recommend uh, if you're ever looking for something to spice things up. And absolutely good dude. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I was kind of like all, all over too. So this is kind of spur of the moment kind of thing. You're like, way to go, Dave, like usual. Stuff in the tournaments. Exactly. Um, should we message Daryl? Or are we going to follow Nina? What's Max Packs up to? Damn, that's still going on. I mean, I'm not surprised because I've seen. Uh, EPT Americas I covered the other day. It was n I had nothing but TVT. I had like one PVT, I think, in in a ZVZ. But like it was like an extensive amount of like forty minute TVTs. Chicken man, how crazy is that? Like I was like I like TVTs, but when they get to those forty minute ones, they're like, you know, I have. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yeah, and uh, so. Yeah. All right, chick, I messaged your alt. Okay, I'm going to message to. Oh, graph? It's graph. In trigger. Uh, okay, we're in this lobby. Okay. Hell yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, I mean, we could... Graph and Trigger, we missed it? Uh, did you start? Let's see. Uh, I think they may have... Shit. Yeah. The coin flip was West Central West, by the way. Yeah, uh, next time I think it was just I'll be honest, it was and just I, the timing. Or am I so say that you just Tanks with the twenty three months, thank you. Nightlight Inc. just subscribe. Um West Central West. I'm gonna try to plan it out a little better next week's one, but Chicken Man, I gotta mention too while we're here, because you're good at this stuff too. Guys, we got fifteen of 20 codes for raid uh, downloads of Raid Shadow Legends on the stream. I'm really hoping to get freaking all like 40 codes or downloads done, guys. 
Because guess what, chicken man? You ready for my big goal? A $1,500 tournament. Planned in advance with, uh, obviously, your premier caster choice number one. But with you, myself, Loco, and Nathanius. And then whoever else on side streams. How, uh, would you be down for that? <laughs> um, oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, we're all in here. Uh, yeah, man. Okay, they need a minute. Yeah, I, I guess so. Feral. Uh, <laughs> dude, yo, we should do that for memes. Uh, that would be the best meme to do for like a first game of the day. Like, like we just get them together and just for confusion, we're just like, hey, chicken man, what's going on? Then we're like, oh, yeah, over here we got this. And over here we just time it out, right? And chat's just like, what? <laughs> that would be the ultimate hard troll on uh, Chigamer and. Uh, shy gamer. He he never corrects me. He gave up. He gave up. <laughs> You're like I've known him for longer. Come on, Dave. But uh, he's yeah, he's from Chi Chicago. <laughs> I'm gonna take a second. If we start, so be it. Uh, you know. Good luck, chicken man. <laughs> I'll be right back, chicken man. I apologize. Thank you. Now, Chicken Man uh, had a thought. I might try doing something a little differently. It may be tougher for you, but if we planned it right, I was thinking of maybe doing an earlier than the Chicken Man or the Cock of the Walk tournament and the, the other way around. I got you. Oh, yeah. No, no. I mean, you don't have to. I'll try to time it out so it's we can make it. We can. Yeah. Where I go in, we go into you or if you'd have me co uh, cover a side or something, if that would be cool in turn. But if we timed it out, we're if we timed it out, we're even if we even if. Well, if, if we timed it out right, we could leave like a little buff, like a guaranteed buffer. You know what I'm saying? So you'd have like a bit of time, like, you know what I mean? Say you get like an hour in the other tournament and I start out early enough where we have, because if it's early enough, we may get Korean. Yeah. Yo, I might crash, uh, I might crash, uh, Trigger and Nina, by the way. <laughs> How funny would that be? I'd be like, Chicken Man, pull up Nina's stream. You'd be like, what the fuck? It's Dave, Trigger, and Nina? <laughs> Just a bit... Talk about Protoss memes. We just be missing you. Honestly, you're one of the people I'm excited to hang out with in Atlanta. I'm hoping it all works out on my end because of the work situation and all that. You know? Yeah, we're all right. 
Now nah, we'll get it. We'll get this planned out a little better next time. If we have other casters, I think we might set up some stuff ahead. I Beryl and Richie are just really good friends of mine, so I do apologize for that chicken man. And honestly, and honestly, if you felt like playing and wanted free coaching, hit up Rich. He's really good. No, yeah, I know. You usually don't have time, and I got you. But and <laughs> true. Who do you want, Chief? And his opponent in the upper right. Uh, I believe he's on prep now, isn't he? Or not? Or am I losing it? It is Percival in the red. I am going to ask him after. One cool thing about Percival is uh, he's one of the Korean players that actually speaks English very well. So he's pretty easy to... Uh, not that there's anything wrong with it. It could be a struggle. So You know, Chicken Man, it could be a struggle sometimes getting uh, in communication with these guys in tournaments sometimes. What a... Oh, he is teamless. Wow. If it wasn't the day after KJ's birthday, nudge, nudge, KJ. Just saying. Just saying. Oh, you... Yeah. Happy belated birthday to KJ Freedom from Psystorm. Thank you for paying the big bucks to wonderful players like Geralt and Max Pax and Special and Nicaract, etc. Gumi God, yeah. I love this. Geralt's got full scouting. Percival cares less. He's like, nah, bro. You can you can just see my one 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 with your trap probe because we're getting this probe one way or another. <laughs> Who is he? Total Recall. Yeah. Feel like we're. <laughs> yeah, I figured you'd be with me on that one. <laughs> <laughs> and we got that movie in this. You know, he said he'd do it in the past, but we, we'd have to do it. One other possibility is if we had slight DJ hours. He did say he may do it. We can get your boy. We can get your boy a pop in with us one time. A pop's casting's pretty good. I like a pop's casting. Like when he, I actually happened to be watching his stream and somebody submitted a replay of uh, me versus them. <laughs> I just happened to crop in. I was like, yo. I I threw a bit, but he a pop actually was it was a, well, a game that I wasn't BM, but I was doing the uh, hero build. He was actually kind of impressed. I was surprised. <laughs> I was like, Dave actually playing not bad. <laughs> yeah, no proxy anything. All right, so, well, let's see. Stargate opener from Geralt. I, I don't know about you, but I kind of like it. I'm wondering if he's going Phoenix Charge, though, or Phoenix Colossus. I'm thinking Phoenix Charge from how it looks. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, it definitely spices it up. I've been seeing a lot more three, uh, two and three gate blink. We have even seen four gate blink uh, a bit more. Uh, which, as you know, we remember that period. Of Actually, when we were starting out our stuff, dude, it seemed like we had so much Phoenix Colossus for a while. I'm not surprised it broke meta, but I'm actually glad to see it come back a bit. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, especially the Phoenixes. I mean, Phoenixes are fast at least, but uh, he may actually catch the... Let's see if he catches the push. Oh, the Marines, I think, were... Yup, they were just in range. Yeah, 100%. That is a bold move trying to keep it with. Oh, now that the second tank's coming. Hey, hey, hey. Who wants to have some fun? Yeah, absolutely. And, uh, yeah, very good stuff. Yeah, it certainly does. Uh, Phoenixes are barely... Barely... That one barely lives. Uh, I don't know about you. I actually don't hate that decision for Geralt to take the... Six o'clock ish base behind all that. And yeah, there's no battery. And uh, char charge is a ways away, though. I mean, it is chrono boosted. For Oh yeah, with Yeah, without stem and combat shields, this is you can just jump on those tanks. And actually with the Phoenix Oh no, the warp in though. No. Yeah, you can Nope. Yo, by the way, uh, I love this from Geralt right here. He's getting a little nod to Hero. He's got the proxy for the charge. Kind of coming into them. I've been seeing this more and more. But a little bit of the Hero style. Just dropping a proxy gate. Yeah, you know, very good stuff. Yeah, that's uh, definitely looking pretty over, Chicken Man. Oh my god, but those Widow Mines. Try buying them some time. The supply is just not there. Yeah. Yeah, he can't do anything. There's no boys' pole capability. Uh, it's three bases, two bases. Uh, Geralt can just basically. Yeah, he's got two robos coming down. My god. This is way ogre. Trying to do the job of, you know, giving chat some uh, hopium here, but nah, it's over, man. Yeah. 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 This is full cope mode right here. Yeah, can we get some... Can we get some sail mules in chat? We need some sail mules in chat. <laughs> Drop those bad boys, cause yeah, EMP or not, there's just nothing to nothing to bring this back. Yeah, my God. Yeah. 
It's easy. Certainly not. He's going to give it all he's got. He somehow eked out all... Yeah, he's got ghosts and widow mines, but there's so many phoenixes. The widow mines aren't going to be able to do anything. Robo bay coming. Yeah, it's... This is... For sure. I mean, this is like... The biggest Terran memes I've seen in, in quite some time. <laughs> yeah. Uh, guys, by the way, uh, thank you, Legoland, and response for the raid, and Nightlight, Mr. Tank, for the 23 months. It is, uh, yeah, greatly appreciated. Of course, we got Chicken Man here, and uh, if you could help us out, please use those uh, please use those Macherino codes. We got Macherino codes, I believe, left. Let's see what the prize pool is at right now. On full hopium, we get all these codes used. Because we are at... We're at one... Ooh, 23 codes remaining. 187, 25. Did we get a... We had a three, $3 text now domestic from Thorn as well. Thank you. Okay. Yep. Yeah. So we're up to 187.25, guys. Please use those Macherino codes. <clears throat> yeah, so first place prize is over $100 now. Because I've uh, changed these up because we didn't know, you know, $100 base before the top four payout. So we got some uh, bigger, kind of like ESL, you know, or EPT. I, I think that's how we should go forward even when we get back to the chicken man test the title opens you know i want to get those going again because uh in in the uh future when we can because we made it up to like 24. so that's pretty based you know what i mean like i just didn't feel right after a while too because you know what i mean you were getting situated and uh, but it just seemed weird without having Chicken Man there. I don't mind it to having, you know, obviously on there, but I'm like, it just doesn't feel right. I don't have my man Chicken Man. Yup. Yeah, the logo is up on both our stream. It's just too nice of a logo. <laughs> Yeah, and his opponent in the upper right representing himself in the red, Mr. Terran Man, is Percival. Hmm. And Geralt looking for proxies. 100%. You know, I... I gotta say, uh, Geralt seems to be coming back into form. I think he's beating his o his biggest op uh, opponent himself. Uh, as you know, Chicken Man, it seems like when once he gets in that rut. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Yep. That was good. I hope I do that. I'm thinking of you. Dude, I'm thinking of you. Like, this whole time is the time I should have, honestly, somewhere in here. But, uh, thinking of you, like I said, when we got together the first time, just the difference. You just seem like you're in a way better quality of life. You're having a lot more fun overall when I'm watching your stream. I know you don't get the stream as much as you'd like to, probably, but it just seems like you're in a good, uh, good place, you know? Yeah. Yeah, imagine if we only needed like 10 minutes of sleep. Wouldn't that be amazing?
<laughs> Oof. Dave casually going to bed at... Dave casually going to bed at... I'd say somewhere between 8 and 9 a.m. today. Yeah. <laughs> uh... Well, it looks like we're not going to have a one more one It's a three racks with a just safe high ground CC from from Percival playing the mind games. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Reaper, Reaper is shut down. Uh, I gotta say, I do like the decision from Percival. Like sometimes you'll see people build the orbital on the high ground, but like when you're for a third CC, sure, but not on your nat if you're pulling one of these, you know. Okay, we got a scouter proxy pylon for drops. It's actually a good spot, truthfully, because that's more. You know, you get a pretty good probability of a uh, medevac going, but we're not going to see any drops in this game for the mo for a little while. <laughs> yeah, I, I'll be honest, too, Chicken Man. I was thinking before I was mentioning, I'm like. I'm surprised we didn't have a speed run finals in yours because we had this tournament. So Christiana uh, opted not to check it because, you know what I mean? Thinking of that, those guys uh, really gave you quite the series at the end, it seemed like, from what little I could catch in. I had you open looking in the corner of my eye, but I didn't see the, I just didn't see who won. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Chicken Man, you're going to be a little sad, but this is what I'm saying on, on time. I got to plan these out more because to give you an idea, some of the people that signed up, we had 34 people. You know how it goes, though. We'll get a lot to sign up, and it's hit or miss if they actually do. But we actually had Solar, Skillis, and some other folks. Neeb's too busy with school right now. But uh, we are going to... If we can plan it out right, expect some... Some new faces and some rare faces. You know what I'm saying? I love it. Dark Shrine versus three racks. I love it. Except for the. <laughs> yeah, and he's mewing like crazy as you should. Uh, but this looks like more like a two base all in or he's set not necessarily all in but this is definitely going to be a really delayed third cc we have the five racks well i mean you usually get your five racks first but this could be no he's going for third no oh, never mind it's a marine <laughs> you know what i'm saying this looks like the two base boys pull kind of push oh ho, ho. And no scans! No scans! Yeah, Percival down to 21 workers, though, Chicken Man. This is looking pretty grim for our Terran player. As DTs are... Oh, wait. There's a missile pair that managed to get up, but the DT may be able to kill it. No. Going to get just out of range. Hmm. Oof. Feels bad, man. This is... Or Percival. He stayed. He was on. I actually woke him up for this. He goes, Thanks for messaging me.
I don't know what happened. Let's see if they're in chat. Sh like I said before, shout out to Rainer for reaching out to his brother because I didn't have a contact for Baby Marine, but I have Rainer. <laughs> you don't know the power of the Dark Shrine. Princeton University. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh... I, no, man, it's, uh, I treat it as, I think Max Pack's Baby Marine or finishing up would be awesome. But, you know what I mean? But either way, I'm fine. Geralt Nick, uh, it's Geralt Nick Racked. That is Psystorm versus Psystorm. And it's Geralt Nick Racked, but Max Pack Baby Marine is definitely a based matchup. Either way, we get a PVT. I'm going to message Gamer Richie in Barrel. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, if Baby Marine wins, what an upset would that be, by the way? It's pa Baby Marine did quite well on Monday, I just want to say. Like quite well, he made it pretty far in in EPT Americas, uh, which was very, you know what I mean. So it's <laughs> I'm checking that group DM. Gamer Richie says Colin Geralt takes the crown. It's, you know how big that would be? Like, that'd be the biggest moral boost for Geralt if he wins in a tournament with Max Pax. <laughs> like, like he... Abs absolutely. Um... Shit, I gotta add something here. Because I had different scenes for stuff. <clears throat> because of the Rage Scam Legends thing. What? <laughs> exactly. I finally caved. Okay, Geralt sent me a lobby link, so... I guess so. Yeah, let's just go. Gamer Richie and Farrell, I think, are done. Farrell said he's too drunk and Gamer Richie's tired. <laughs> uh, here it is. Now I feel better. We have Scuff Chicken Man back on the stream because of the raid stuff. I was like, that. damn it, I wanted it before, but here he is. Yeah. What, what do you think of my new uh, emote, by the way, that... Uh, 47 this did. I'll, I'll type it in your chat here. I up. It's no longer Scuff Dave, but people want Scuff Dave too. We have. Yeah. It's the 47 this um, Dave. Absolutely. I'm hoping to get Crass to do one, too. I only want, like, a few good emotes. Like, I mean, I shouldn't say good. I I'm hoping to improve my stuff, but chat doesn't let me do art anymore. Even though I'm not pushing for partner anytime in the near future or ever, probably, knowing me. But they are done. Yeah, well, let me make sure. Uh, yeah, they're going. I'm glad to see we got both got a good turnout tonight, too. Uh, I was trying to get convinced steadfast to do it, but he's like, bro, Sundays are my... He wasn't, like, mad or anything. He's just like, Sundays have officially become my, like, day off, if at all possible. I'm like, check it. I'm like, steadfast. We can pay you in tens of dollars. 
<laughs> That's where I got him to laugh, you know. <laughs> Imagine how many burgers you could buy with those tens of dollars, all right? Who's that? And, you know, not so much of a burger guy in the upper left. More of a taco kind of kind of a Terran player. It's Nicarak, also from Psystorm. Yeah, I'm thinking he's more of a taco sort of guy. He doesn't get him in Europe as much, so he's like... Nah, he's probably a burger guy, too. <laughs> I... I, I <laughs> Yeah, I don't think so. Did I tell you I actually managed to get Geralt in an interview? By the way, I, I can't remember if I did, told you that. It was that was that it took some doing. He's always like, nah, man. He's like, well, to be honest, I'm nervous of my, uh, you know, my English speaking. And I'm like, bro, you're sound fine. Yeah. I miss the pylon show days of stuff like we like yeah. yeah I'm gonna change it pay I think we're gonna have some more pylon stuff if I I don't know if I'm still a patreon patreon for pylon show I was hoping uh, it seemed like we were getting in full swing then I'm like what's what's going on we should ask uh Yeah. Oh. Yeah, to Canada. I mean, we had A-Pop doing him for a while in Nish. In Sale. I miss seeing you on the Pylon show, honestly. <laughs> Oof. Like a normie who loses his reapers with under three minutes. Look at this, proxy Stargate. Yeah, exactly. It's gonna sound crazy as much as Geralt's my dude. Uh, I feel like Nicarak's the favored player of this matchup just by, in terms of how many times He's been I, actually cruising on so these. That you just blew your mind. If you don't mind, I have Green a certain Ultra special shout out my I have to give here. Green A M O V E. Mr. Green, one of my founder badge here with 25 months with Prime. With the founder badge. With A moves. He's the he's the guy that made those videos, all those Dave meme videos with the uh Revenge of the Simp and you know, the Star Wars memes. You've seen them, I'm pretty sure, Chicken Man, right? <laughs> yeah, there are you. Big base. Those founder badge folks, you know. I can't believe I'm at that point where I'm at 25 months now. Like, it's. I you know you've been through that point in time. Now you're getting to crazy times. You know what I mean? Yeah, that was beautiful. Actually, that was, felt like a... It wasn't even like that crazy of a place Widow Mine, but that felt like out of the book of Beyond right there. <laughs> you know? Yeah. And the this Widow Mine drop's gonna be... At least the drop's gonna be scouted. But oof, yeah, 300... Minerals and 175 gas loss for Geralt so far is very rough. Oh, yeah, you should be able to get one Widow Mine, but the Phoenix, I think, might go down. Oh, no, it was a beautiful micro from Geralt Chicken, man. Yeah, 
And his, his Nexus is down at a fairly good time, at least, though, too. But yeah, it's still... Yeah, good... good. I think I'd say altogether good trades for both players, in a way. Uh, but that said, this Phoenix... Oh, wait! Oh. Yeah, the Adept scouted it. Ooh. I was not watching it as much. I, I definitely caught things. It was more from from the YouTube when you, Day 9 was casting, but uh, not as much, we should say. Like, I enjoyed StarCraft, but I was not uh, onto the pro scene as far. You know what I mean? I was just a casual. <laughs> Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I wish he surprised us if, like, especially if, like, we see the end of stuff and we had Day 9 up here. Uh, just in lieu of the changes happening at Blizzard, I know he said he was done with Blizzard. Uh, just with, like, a tail end of big StarCraft tournaments. Like, surprise, it's Day 9. That would be so, so freaking based. Oh, yeah. That's true. Yeah. Yeah, this is... <laughs> oh, for sure. For sure. I have... I'm serious when I say I'm like... Everybody's super stoked for that. But just me knowing me... Maybe it's my age. I have a feeling I'm probably going to end up sticking around with StarCraft, too. <laughs> well, everybody else, with whomever's left. But Dave's going to be holding down the fort. Oh, yeah. The perpetual quest for Dave getting never getting masters with all the 100 player base. <laughs> <laughs> but Dave <laughs> Oh my gosh Too funny I do like we have Psystorm going this game uh, Well literally pun intended Psystorm versus Psystorm with the Well with the Psionic Storm <laughs> Out of Geralt. But he is going to be against uh, an enhanced shockwave ghost. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, the thing is, it, it depends on the, the builds, too, though, you know, like, this is, it's not a double eBay build, which, you, you know, you'll, well, it is a double eBay build, but he hasn't been, he didn't hammer to it, he, I think he got that second eBay a little later, uh, as you normally do with this build, so you can get that Ghost Academy a little quicker, rather than the, you know, this, uh, quicker upgrades for Terran, but, oh, do we get storms? No, we don't! Oof. You call the chicken, man. That's what I expected too, but. <laughs> oh, beautiful storm! Oh. 
Why? Yeah, he oh, he should have just stayed with some stalker. Like, these are such injured medevacs. He could have depleted a lot of the army. Thank you, extra. Yeah, we have. Ooh. Yeah, he's going to lose another base he's trying to hold. Actually, I think this is going pretty well for Geralt. He's got more workers. His army's actually not too bad. You know, obviously there's a lead for our Karen, but not, there was a lead. That storm just, oh my God. BG. Yeah, very, very cool stuff. And Gamer Richie could put his odds on Geralt to win the finals. That should be interesting. So it's we'll see how it goes. Oh, I'm sorry. It was Trigger versus Backpacks. Or that's just happening. Okay. I would have asked them to hold off, but I mean, I don't want to tie you. You're back to back between you and, but namely these guys too, being in EU and it's getting late. And Max Pax mentioned, well, you know, it's a little late. Goblin was saying, nope, I fixed my sleep schedule. That's why he bailed on us. I'm actually in good hours. And I told, I told them I'm, I'm proud of you. Well, I mean, for those guys, it's, you know, it, these tournaments don't, that's the thing is no matter no matter how many people i i never have good luck when i do mine for a long it's very rare that we get a tournament longer than three hours these days no matter how much money's there it's insane Yeah. But then, but they, but they still get into like such late times. You know what I mean? Like they get in full on tryhard mode. So, yeah. And it wouldn't be prudent at this juncture not to introduce this Terran in the upper left with a thousand points a lot. His Nicarac. Very bad George H.W. Bush impersonation. Out of nowhere, just because. Yeah. Wouldn't be prudent at this juncture. Uh, yeah, I'm not. I'm, I'm not. I, I you honestly I'm usually yeah I'm usually on point with that but I think I'm uh, I'm a little tired. <laughs> Dave's feeling a little sleepy. Yeah, I've had some, but I didn't have enough coffee. I got a Pepsi going here, and that, that's good for you to try to cut down on the caffeine. Yeah, dude. Oof. Yeah, I, I'm more of a Coca-Cola guy. I just happened to get Pepsi for some reason. I don't know why. I was just like, I think it was on sale or something. Yeah, and I, I was just feeling a change up. Exactly. Oh, yeah. No, I'm with you. Yeah, that is 100% with you. Ooh, that is a pretty good delay from that probe, though, on that uh, CC, truthfully. By the way, that was the... What's your thoughts on Dr. Pepper? Heck, yeah. Renegade and I were just talking about that. Uh, I had my first cast with Renegade in forever on Monday, too, by the way. <laughs> uh, so if I don't have... <laughs> 
Doing all right. I guess there was a, a bit of a problem I was seeing. I didn't get too into it on getting an apart uh, an apartment kind of move situation. But uh, Renegade seemed to be doing pretty well. We uh, uh, thinking of friendos here. But no, chicken man, I am stoked for Atlanta though too. But like. We got to hang out one time and it was kind of a weird time because, you know, you're home for the holidays for the first time in years and stuff. But when we're actually kicking back in the live Starcraft land with bars and everybody, that's going to be so fun, dude. <laughs> I'm actually really looking forward to hanging out with you, though. Yeah. I, oh, yeah. I'm, I'm waiting to the last minute. Not last minute, but... Uh, yeah. Yeah, I might. Mm hmm. Yeah, I'm sure we can. We'll get the fan be helping the fan for all this like i even had i might have to change plans i might be staying with freaking Drickette now from yeti and i have no idea what i'm doing to be honest we'll see i do know i'm gonna troll the shit out of sale though <laughs> Yeah, I'm ex Yeah, it's gonna be- I- I- Yeah, usually every time I talk- like, Sal and, uh, I'm looking forward to meeting Steadfast. I have a feeling when we're in that kind of environment, if he's not casting, that is, uh, and he's in low-key mode, he's gonna be more like- like Dave is in chat, you know what I mean? Like when he's talking to chat, he's just like everybody's bud. If you, you know what I mean, locate. I'm a really, but having steadfast and sell with chicken, man. I, I'm looking forward to just everybody. I'm looking forward to meeting a lot of my chat, to be honest with you. <laughs> yeah, dude, we got a lot of. Let's, let's, let's be real, chicken, man. We got some really big supporters, both of us, you know? Yeah, they're awesome. Hell yeah. Absolutely. Uh, speaking of impeccable taste, let's see if we get an impe impeccable blink, which is unlikely with the Raven and the Cyclone Chase. I think that's almost as good as a tank, uh, in my opinion, because well, if it's in position, because the auto turret and the lock on. Oh, look at this. Is it? Nope. Well, thinking of you and the clip that I snagged for that one clip, I need to add that command back here, make it different, and shorten it up. But uh, quote the Raven, nevermore. <laughs> yeah, that time fucking flies, man. This is just, it's nuts. All right, army supply are really in favor of Nicarak naturally, though. He's tearing, you know, they are pumping out more stuff. And Jarrell going for a fast fourth. Mm hmm. Oh, he can get it. Oh, my God. He one done. You know, if he can debate him to the other side, that'd just be amazing to see, like, three tanks just clumped up. Yeah. Oh, nice rev tag. Yeah, he's buying time for that Psy Storm and the plus one armor. Mm-hmm.
Yup. Yeah, he's definitely gonna want to cancel. Oh wait, is he though? <laughs> yeah. It. Yeah, I need. Oh. Yeah, it was a little off from perfection, but it's still a good, damn good one. And Geralt takes. Geralt. You know why that is, Chicken Man? His location of his fourth base where he actually decided where he wanted it to after he debated to buy time. He's taking gold. Oh. And I like that there's still a proxy Stargate. So, I mean, it's slow warp ins, but hey, uh, this could get extra spicy. Honestly, it's gonna sound nuts, but would be 500 IQ would be to build another Oracle because I don't think it would scout. The main base has really gotten much of in terms of scout from Nickerack. I'm just gonna check. No, he didn't. So. He has no idea what's going on or where the oracles came from, so he has no idea that that's a uh, proxy Stargate as of now. So we could potentially see uh, just one oracle. Like, who would do that, though? You know what I mean? At this time. Yeah, excellent choice. Well, that said, this proxy Stargate's gonna be scouted as he drops a, uh, Nickerack drops a CC. Oh, buddy. Yeah, well. Yeah, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Yeah, and that's one dead uh, pylon in Stargate. Uh, meanwhile, Jarrell is going to push a Karat. Oh, he's just splitting Zealots off to go try to get that value in the third. Mm-hmm. Oh, no. The High Templar just got taken down to Kirktown. God. Yeah, that was devastating. He even managed to save a robo. Uh, Geralt doing one of those things that just makes me absolutely mauled. Building not just one robo, the robotics bay, and then the, it doesn't matter, but you know. He won. But that's such a. I've seen so many games where, like, even Geralt has just lost because of putting their, their robos in the third. Yeah, so let's see. He is.
Okay, yeah, let's try to catch them. It's a good estimation. Unless they are into game number two. Damn, I, I get... Hmm. Ooh, our boy Han Mano took a game off Baby Marie, at least. That's a close one, honestly. I was going to say, but that, that could have been either way. <laughs> um... Okay. Absolutely. I'll hold them up if they get it done. Well, chat, this should be an interesting time. We got Trigger versus Max Packs. We'll see what's going on. And, uh, yeah. Guys, if you want to help out. Yeah, Richie's calling it. You think Geralt's going to take it all. Geralt won that matchup, at least. Yeah, I should have grabbed those from you. Like, I, I... Just because of time, I'd been slipping on that in the past. I'd always try to at least do them for you, but um, I want to try to add them into my disc. I want to redo my Discord, which I keep talking about, but I'm going to put make sure, if nothing else, in announcements, I want to put your matcherinos in. And feel free to do that yourself, too. Just in case. I know it's, it's not much, but there's a freaking shit ton of people in my Discord. Um. Yeah, we changed it from the drunk tank, fittingly. To saw hey, what do you think for the change? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh man. So yeah, guys. Thank you all. Dan Mako again was a a legend. I have to do this because not only did he do do donate one hundred twenty five dollars for this tournament. Sponsor to the other ones. We put on more for it. And then he comes in and donates 20 subs today. What a freaking legend. You might say he's a little bit of a Dave fan. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I don't get it, but people seem to be sticking around the old Dave Twitch for some reason. You know? When we got like... I will I will say uh I'm sure I'm definitely gonna be on later tonight for some ladder. But I ha I am hoping at some point we can go. I my girlfriend's gonna be gone for the week and I as you always hear, I, I never I spend enough time with her, but I actually she's gonna be giving me a hand getting this new I, I finally got a new mattress, which hopefully will help sleep. Uh it's one of those box uh memory foam things i don't know never done one <laughs> so yeah i could just see a disaster of dave doing it and somehow screwing that up yeah i'll just frame it yeah that'll be even oh god chat i think the chat would probably pay to see that <laughs> people still want a dave cooking stream it's been a long time so soon I need to quit. Dude, that would be badass. <laughs> There's been so many times, Chicken Man, though, for real. I've thought about it. I'm like, one day, I just hope. I, it's hard for us. But one day, I hope we have a live cast together. One, and somehow, some way. Like, how fucking badass would that be? Like, <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, man. Worst case, yeah, exactly. I'll, I, worst case, I'll bring the, uh, I'll just bring my MV7X and my uh, Waves XLR or something, or we do whatever with it, you know. Just to, you got it all in the waist. Hell yeah. No, it's funny when I was talking in your chat, by the way, I was just saying, like, naturally, I was surprised with this dynamic mic. If I don't have any, uh, uh, compression on. I think it's the small room I'm in. It picks up my... 
I spent thirty dollars on a plugin just because I was desperate and stuff on where I would I would have bought. I have oh this is gonna sound crazy so I have my Wave XLR which I'm using for this, um I'm using, and I have my focus right it's still good it just was the Discord issue I use that for I finally got Ableton Live figured out music man music man chicken man Jesus fuck, so, but I've been playing more guitar on stream so I'll be using an Amplitude um have plans of getting a bass. Uh, so we might actually be able to do, I'll be like, Chicken Man, I got some tracks, we gotta make a StarCraft song, and then we, we can convince Sal to lay on drums one day. Yo, Dan Mako! Gifted 20 subs to fucking Chicken Man, let's go, he's got love for the man of chickens. That... For this guy always putting up with Dave, several weeks in a row. Dude, not only did you get, you know, some good subs, you got a lot of really, like, you, you know, you got some really cool people in there, you know what I'm saying? No, that's uh, Dave Le Dave Letos, who uh, plays in a lot of tournaments. Sir Duke Nukem's in every chat. Back, backspace of Chad. Flapjack. Uh, freaking Geralt. And... If you don't walk in stone, you ain't coming home. Yeah, I mean, all right, we can... Certainly, uh, we can certainly do that. It depends on, on on mine from where I'm at, where I'm like, yeah, I've had times where it's been pretty cracked, but yeah, we could uh, we could totally we should do something to that effect in the future for sure. We, we don't always have to do the same thing every you know every week. I actually I we did a paid Acheron versus Slipjet best of seven on Friday, by the way. And they even did it. They did a comeback game uh, when Steadfast and I casted them forever back. It was Proxy Ghost versus Proxy DTs. And Slipchip somehow threw that game in the past. But this time he came back. <laughs> it was like some of the dumbest StarCraft you could see. It was great. <laughs> Yep. Yeah, it was about 150 when I got it, but yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, you can you can check. Well, it's the software with it is why. Oh, we got it in the lobby. Yeah, no. It, yeah, no, it's. Oh, well, no, it is the, the. Well, we can blame. I thought about it, and I'm, the only reason I got this, because the focus rate sounded great, was because the Discord, it was Sal who convinced me to get it. So what, who am I to argue with Sal? You know what I'm saying? That's, yeah, now you see, I was bitching about it. It, it screwed up our interview with Ravi. It made you, Bale, Mulf, and Florencio go deaf. This thing's been a nightmare, but we got the finals. I'm assuming it's zero. They did? Trigger and Max Packs did? Oh shit. Oh. Uh. And his opponent in the bottom left. Representing Team Super in the yellow. Give it up for a trigger. Wait, this isn't the finals. This is the semis. 
it could be one one for all we know I, i'm am yeah I'm, I'm i'm actually putting that in there too six and nine it's nice i'm with you chicken man that's beautiful good stuff yeah no i believe me i i could have I, I could have figured it out on my own at the time like i you know what i mean i embarrassingly have a background it was just more the obs and just from you know what i'm saying and i can sell this i mean honestly it works great when you figure it out but like you have to do so much bullshit for I, I always for i'll forget stuff like i'll be like all right let's play another game or let's show this and nobody's hearing audio and i'm like oh i have to go in the windows side and and yeah that yeah. oh dude Yeah, exactly. Like I, I would be fine with a, a mixer interface. Like I, the thing is for me, ideally, like why I hope the focus rate would work fine. And again, it was just the Discord bug, which still I'm surprised. I bet you now, knowing my luck, they actually finally fixed it with drivers. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But uh, that said, we got ourselves a typical Max Packs trigger game. Both little greedy boys, uh, but. <sighs> Yeah. I think Max X forced the block, forced it with the probe, and I don't know. Yeah, this is definitely something. And. I, I can picture Nina just flaming trigger right now. Like, yo, because of the results, Nina's over there flaming trigger, like, uh, so he, like, scuffs the wall. I do think it's funny they were playing the game, like, right next to each other. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. I gotta say, I, I miss Nina being on the roster for for our players. You know. Still up one gal. Oh. Green batter. Oh my god, the double or <laughs> 13. Yes. Yeah, the only thing really buying him time is the fact that Max Pax is just starting blink and he's full walled in. Uh, and if naturally Max Pax being Max Pax, he is going to... Okay. Oh yeah, actually the stalker fit. Hmm, I'm surprised. Yeah. It, it looked like it. I had, I'm had. i just turning. For some reason when I was looking at it, it did look like it. It's very, yeah, it's very obviously a gap. Um, And then obviously speaking of gaps, there's triggers wall, if we can call it that. More like a picket fence. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, yeah. Max Pax 
kind of doing him a favor if it was in this state of the game. Blink's going to finish, but it, it's just more versus less chicken, man. I don't think this is going to... Let's ask what the let's ask what the score was. Do Nina and Trigger live together? Yes, they do, chat. Guys, if you're new here, please smash that follow button. We're trying not to be rude on the uh, co-cast stuff on both Chicken Man and Ice channels. We're always looking for new people, new friendos. Oh, is one. <laughs> I dude I know it's like everybody's got their trade secrets but bro I could use some help just even getting a start on some ideas I had not like ripping you off but I I think it's time we need to improve like I've I've like it's a time consuming thing but just to get some pointers cuz I'm so tired of this generic streamlabs bullshit you know what I mean And his opponent in the upper right from Team Super in the red representing Canada. It's Trigger. The Prince of Denmark. Hmm? Yeah, it's just... Because... It, uh, it, it's more like the interact... Some of the interactive stuff I've seen. I'm like, how the hell do I even start this? And I'm looking in GitHub and everything else. And I'm, every time I'm just like, all right. Let's just smash that ladder button. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, I'd like to... But I think people would like it, too, because... Uh, it, design ideas sure welcome but i'm also gonna be hmm, hmm? uh my stream it... uh, my... yeah but my stream they they tend to pick, for whatever reason they pick up on it because as you know, the uh, my intentions are going to be to have the Dave, <laughs> Scuff Dave, the theme going on with whatever we do. You know what I mean? <laughs> um, but no, you're yeah, you're the stuff you put in. I always it's, uh, it's one thing I've always enjoyed about your stream, but you're always improving. Even if you're like gone, I'm like, you come back your stream. It's even cooler. I'm like your new apartment. I'm like. Rip that awesome room. Now, this looks even cooler, in my opinion. So, your current setup. The room was badass, though, too. Mm hmm? Yeah. It's... Yeah. Look at the big psych out on a trigger. I love this. Trigger going for a four gate in base. Uh, potentially with a proxy pylon after. Yep, there it is. Yeah. Yeah, he's trying to drain some energy from the battery. It's not going to do much. Uh, this is a very artosis pylon and only one battery for now, but some of this was scouted. I don't know. If, yeah, Max Pax is so good at React. You know what I mean? He's the PvP Yoda. I 
I would say... I would say Trigger is the other PvP. He, he's getting up there. You know what I mean? He's certainly up there amongst these guys. But we got Geralt. We got... Uh, Geralt moving into the finals, though, too. That's actually... In, in, either way, it's a great PvP finals. If we are stuck with a PvP finals. I just want to compliment. I want to compliment Trigger on its target flare on his own zealot for a second. <laughs> oh! Yeah, that second Void Ray coming, though, is going to be a bit rough. Uh, he wasn't able to put just enough pressure on to fully damage the Stargate to deny it, but this could go either way, Chicken Man. Seriously, this is on the knife's edge, I feel like. Yeah, this is a battle of patience for Trigger now, because Max Pax hasn't been able to build workers behind her, and I think that patience is going to pay off. So many stalkers. Oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> Has he done it? Yeah, Max Pax is so good at one gate expands. Trigger too, but I am in awe, chicken man. We made to see it. Oh, but but Max Pax managed. Look at Max Pax behind this as he's losing drops of pile. He's so good. Like that just shows, even though he's behind, Max Pax is that good. He managed to squeak a probe and then drop a pylon for sentry or er, adepts. Neither of us caught that, but like, hello? That just a testament to his skill. Oh. Why did Trigger send four? Yeah, uh... Hmm. Yeah, Max Pack's going for an Immortal. Trigger going for Robo, too. I don't hate the Robo, but... Uh, truthfully, what I would have done... Personally, I think a... Twilight Council and going in... It, it's gonna sound crazy, but going into charge, because... It's one of those things that Max Pack's is it, kind of a... In some ways, he's a bit of a predictable player at this point with his one gate builds. Like, his, he's usually Void Array Immortal, you know? And he might cheek in it. Mm hmm. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, at this At the same Yeah, he does. At the same time, I feel like Trigger could have just ended the game, but that pylon was enough to get into his head. I truthfully, cuz he he had the army supply. He could have he could have pressed the issue and went all in, but seeing that pylon in his base, I you know what I mean? And playing against Max Pax, I think his nerves were ticking. Because now this is looking... Wait. Max Pax still kept his workers alive, though. Look at it. The worker count's pretty even, though. He's oversaturated. Yeah. But he's dropping another Nexus behind us. Yeah. 
Yeah. If this now, I hope if Trigger takes his max packs, doesn't dip out of my tournaments for a while because he's disappointed. I don't think he will because he likes playing StarCraft for his love of the. That kid actually does play for true passion, you know. And. Oh my god. Yeah, I need the replay of game number one of this. I think this is going to be a, this already is looking, depending on the outcome. Yeah, look at, we got a third Nexus. PvP, man, this is where it gets, the beauty of PvP. Somehow we end up in a three Nexus, two Nexus game. Uh, still a game? Yeah. That is, for sure. I, you know who will be, I have a feeling is going to really appreciate the entirety of this series? And I'm sure the first game was crazy, but I'm pretty sure Winter and Lokar would be very, very happy to receive replays of this. <laughs> this is a good one. I'm glad we're casting it. Heck on you, Winter and Lokar. We're casting this originally. <laughs> Exactly. Oh my god. Nah, but truth, if we're doing, you know, tournaments like this, I always hope we can have more people getting to catch the cool games, you know? Yeah. What a madman, dude. I love it. This is spicy. Disruptor glaive. I mean, it's rough against stalkers. Let's be real, like the resonating glaives. Uh, but I don't know. Is he just styling at this point? Or I wonder what the. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, and I think the double Stargate, he's thinking of late game, but as we see, it's going to be Phoenixes for the Disruptors and not a lot in the air for Max Packs to contest the Phoenixes. So they're going to be able to get some pretty good potential Disruptors. Yeah, there's only two Stalkers and two... St this this is a bit of a build order counter, I feel like. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is a beautiful game. Uh, truthfully. I wish this was the best of five. <laughs> like, honestly, this is too good. Oh my god, Trigger took it! Holy shit, I cannot believe we saw that. That is Geralt. I mean, I can. Trigger is cracked. Do we have a new PvP Yoda? I totally didn't just message Trigger that. <laughs> oh my gosh.
Wait, I forgot to update the title forever. Oops. This is crazy. I mean, it's PvP, so it's going... We've seen Neeb go down to draw... On... I had some sad... I had some sad news. Cuckoo couldn't make it because he's been very sick for the last few days. He, which he... If he messaged me this late, that means he was... He's not sleeping well. Poor kid. Looks like we're going to uh, stay in the Americas. Uh, Trigger is he's in Ohio at the moment. Yeah, but normally he's in Canada. Uh, east, east is fair. Yeah, east because it's it's Geralt, it, Geralt's in you. It's always east like usual. Do we do a coin? Should we coin flip? We didn't really put it in the news. We can bounce game the game. All right. I have to pee though. <laughs> so, but very cool stuff. We have Trigger and Geralt in the finals upcoming. Uh, very well played. And thanks to all the people that have stuck around. Chicken Man, thanks for hanging around after Cock of the Walk, too. Are you happy? After the abrupt, like, we had four casters, but tell me those guys aren't awesome. You're like the first time in voice, probably an awkward thing, but I'm telling you, like, it's uh, a blast. Yeah, absolutely. I will be uh, right back. Yeah. Mr. Chicken Man's taking a break too, or no? Okay. Oh, gotcha. If you change your mind and you're looking for somebody to hang out with, just saying. I actually enjoyed doing that the last couple. Like, ESL is the kind of thing where. We're It's kind of... Hell yeah. Base Shy Gamer. I love Shy Gamer. He's so... I, except for I always call you Chig Gamer or Chigamer to mess with you. Yeah. But he's a good... He's, he's, he's a blast. One of the fun ones in chat. And chat, sorry for neglecting all you guys. Thank you all for being as active... And such, but anybody new here, smash that follow button, please and thank you. Smash it. And appreciate that. Me, not so... But I just did it right now, thank you. We, we, we had a couple, but that's awesome. We haven't been able to stream that much in the last four months is the only reason chicken, man. So, you'll, you'll get them back.
Oof. All right, spawning in the upper right hand corner of Data C, changing it up this time. I'm gonna cast Chicken Man's like, I'm getting tired of looking at this guy in the blue. It's Gerald. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, honestly, can't, do you actually get tired of casting Charlotte, though? Because, to be honest, like, he's put on a hellish show. He's like, honestly, one of the, if not the largest clip I have on my channel was a massive disruptor shot in one of our opens. Sadly, you couldn't make it. It was. He actually had game-winning damage from Disruptors against Neeb, who was not paying attention to his army in the middle of the map. <laughs> it was actually Omega-based. Mm-hmm. And it looks like... Oh, yeah. Actually, my two biggest clips, ironically, are both Disruptors. It was, uh... The other being Nina versus Special in one of my first large tournaments I hosted. It, that was in a finals too, with a crowd cast of like five of us just screaming with like half the mics being all like subpar. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. I'll be honest, dude, like when you're with me and or whatever, like to be honest, dude, I was hoping to get in uh, had we planned it, but thinking of this, I got to remember to hit up Mr. Richie, whatever, but obviously his brother Flo, uh, see, he's, he's, he gets along good with us. You know what I'm saying? Mr. F F Florencio. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. I was just saying like, as we had them. Okay, beautiful delay. Yeah, exactly. Brother Flo. I mean, I am still, I think it's cool he joined our team too. Like just to be just the fact that Florencio on a pro team is 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 interesting. And long deserved, I think. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, he's really hoping to, too, depending on work. Like, dude, that's exactly... Speaking of somebody I really want to meet, that that's... He is quite... He's on the, the number one spot, potentially, of uh, other people. My buddy Yeti... Actually, he's number one, I have to admit it, for people I've not been able to hang out with in real life. But then, Lowe's pretty up there. Sal's somewhere up there, you know, actually, when I think about it. Somewhere. You know me, dude. I'm excited to be everybody. Chat knows it. I know it. Yeah. Like, seriously, shout out to my chat. Like, you guys, like, I've said it to them. Like, they're, they're literally like my Tom Servo and, and whatever the fuck for the guy in Mystery Science Theater 3000 is, like, absolutely mauled on ladder from being bad at the video game, so. You guys are all... Yeah, you're like, Dave, we got a game? Get some work done. Oh. oh. Well, there's no recall available, and it is going to greet. Oh, I won't actually. Just missing the phoenixes for the moment. That actually traded out, uh, in my opinion. I think that was. Kind of even. 
Uh, in terms Game of... Closed. Yeah. Oh, yeah. D yeah, that stasis trap, that, this mining advantage is still clicking in pretty... Yeah, that was a pretty significant one. I'm the back my fly. <laughs> what? <laughs> Fuck, sir. Can somebody clip that? Can somebody clip that? That's amazing. Good. Yeah, what's it? Fuck, Zergs. Oh, beautiful. I can picture, I can picture Trigger just kick, chuckling over there about that too after Gerald said that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they equal army supply base, equal army and workers, like literally. You're going to see that little flux of a unit or two, but like that's crazy how even it is. Just uh, different army comps, uh, potentially. I think they're just going to end up in the same, uh, truth be told. Both these guys look like they're blink stalkers. makes sense logically after it happens but it has to it's something you don't think of it like you know what i mean it, after it happens you can process it for a little bit and you're like oh okay but it's it's just it's kind of like like you said you get command and conquer in late game tvt but pvp can start out in cheese fest and somehow end into like a what appeared to be if somebody just chimed in on normal macro game insane Yeah, it was getting stale for me for a while, and then it it's really, overall, I have to say, it is, people complain about it at times, I'm like, no, I, I wish we saw more at, at the highest league tournaments, honestly, because it's, uh, that's where it gets extra crazy, you know what I mean? Yeah, we, I mean, yeah, that's why we do... Yeah, I, I, in fact, I got a hold of, like, one of the tokens, or we did have bio ice today, but... Oh no, it's a snipe! <laughs> well, Jarrell had plus one, he got the Nexus, and damn, that was such good trades for Jarrell. Yeah, that wasn't a cancel. That's where I was shouting out. <laughs> we had a lot going on right there. We were both uh, gasping in terror at both. But yeah, that was a full snipe on the next. And then, like you said, that plus one advantage actually kicked in. Uh, I th hmm. uh, well, I, I think he's anticipating the charge, which Geralt does have so he, if he gets in uh, truthfully if you one colossi doesn't do that much if he gets like two it actually can be pretty good and it kind of evens out i think it's two or three you need four would be four would just be uh four would be a sail throw emote <laughs> yeah i mean because what else are they good against? Like, they're not good against stalkers, really. For... Yeah, that's true. Except for disruptors. <laughs> and phoenixes. 
I mean, yeah, I mean shut up, Dave. There's, we we're, air units are illegal, all right? I actually, I've actually wrote that to, to opponents in PvP. But yo. Or if I, I died in muted, I'm like, bro. I give you the honor of not going sky toss. And you're building mutas. Or broodlords. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I... I yeah, I'm not either. I, I've seen some cool players. Sephron's a player that likes to pop out the... He has some interesting builds, but it's kind of... A, I don't want to say it's a, a bit of a gimmick usually, but this is actually used at this time. I'm with you. That's what I'm saying. It's not... You're relying at... Like, now all Geralt has to do is not build charge lots a lot. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's that's the answer. What, what, oh, and then he morphed in. <laughs> he did... Oh! Disruptors are out though. Yeah, he's in a fantastic position. But Trigger's such a madman. Don't be surprised that even if he's behind an army supply, if he keeps if he can keep this pressure on, Trigger's the type of lad that'll take a fifth base behind this as this pressure's going on before Geralt, even though he's behind. Now Geralt's going for it. I've seen him do it though, you know. Usually it's when he's ahead, but Yeah, I think he forgot this. The Colossi made him think, forget that disruptors were a thing, yet he's playing against them. Oh! Hey, Cinder, thanks for getting that clip. And we have some heavy predictions. It's too bad we don't have any predictions in chat. Or uh, Geralt favored. And I'll be honest, Chicken Man, Geralt, like we say, is a player, when he gets momentum, that's when he usually dominates in tournaments. And he already won one today, so he's... If, if he wins back-to-back, -back, he's going to be feeling quite good. Like it, could, it was, but like it, the disruptors kind of normalized it out a bit. But yeah, Trigger ultimately traded out more, or like he traded out to get, the, get into a better stalker position. Like you said, though, no disruptors is so weird out of Trigger. I would like to see a star. Like if he's in this position, he just got a fifth base. He's still in it. He was behind. I really would like to see him if he's just gonna stay on stalkers. Try to save some money, get some stargates, and get into carriers. Because if you if you debate enough disruptors out or DTs, which Geralt's doing, but you know what I mean, carriers. That's where carriers can start to shine if you can uh, cheekily uh, get enough of them out without your opponent knowing when they're heavily tied up in disruptors. Is what I hate carriers, but it's just the nature of the matchup. Yep. Ooh, but the disruptors are both in a they're in a very vulnerable position. 
Yeah, pincer. Yeah. I am gonna message my girlfriend. <laughs> so uh, that was a Geralt win. Yeah, I am feeling a little tired. I'm, uh, I gotta say, I'm a little a little bit of proud of, of both these guys. And I'm not disappointed in Max Pax. I'm very thankful he came and played win or lose, and hopefully he took something out of it. Even if that something is, imagine Protoss. And just to take, oh, sorry. There you go. Go for it, go for it. upper left give it up for our red team super super protoss it is trigger who bested max packs and this th i gotta say though that's been the beauty of these tournaments there's been so many upsets in tournaments I've hosted that I just, I, I'm really going to be trying desperately to look through replays. I got to rewatch, remember, just look at the brackets. <laughs> because there's stuff of times past that I really think could, even though it be, had former patches or not, get some. And as underscore Lord God says, is this the realest tester? Uh, really get some better exposure just for the players. Because. We saw upsets with Zest, with Neeb, with, you know what I mean? Just all sorts of guys. And the fact that you and I got to cast Zest in some of his last tournaments too, Chicken Man, was pretty based. I, I, yeah, it's, you know how many times, I actually got sad a couple of times. I've literally still to this day, am going through to message players that play and I almost message Zest every time. It, it, it's a feel sad, man. But, uh, yeah, this is, is it? I don't know. This I'm pretty hyped over this finals. Like, the fa just the fact that we have Trigger and Geralt in a tournament that we had Max Pax and Nicarak, uh, who played very well. At least he, you know, he, he, he and Max Pax can at least go back with some money. Some of the players molding, they can't get their smaller prize if this is a top four payout. But co consequently... It does give for a little bit bigger of a prize for uh, even the semifinalists. Uh, speaking of which, I saw more match Reno commands being used, so thank you guys. Yeah. Prize pool up to 188.25. It's all right, me too. I actually, if I'm smart, maybe I won't stream tonight and I'll get some stuff done and, and go to bed, but we'll see what happens knowing Dave. 
Yeah, I have a lot of stuff I need to do that I'm thinking of uh, potentially doing just that. Yeah, and uh... Yeah, I knew we weren't going to see any double gates uh, in at least what would it appear to be so in Trigger versus Max Packs, but Draw and Trigger, we definitely had a possibility. Ooh, I love... Ooh, that Sentry... Or the Adept play from... Uh, ooh, but that was a beautiful save from, uh, from Trigger. He actually managed to split it. Didn't deny him both. Oh. Yeah, now Geralt delayed on his Nexus, but he's ahead on workers now, Chicken Man. This is looking, yeah, pretty good. And these guys uh, going easy. Yeah, Chat pointed out the trigger change from yellow to red going Super Saiyan. But you know what? I think they're just going easier on the caster eyes. No, they don't think about us. They, they don't think about us, Chicken Man. Let's be real when it comes to that stuff. We're, ha we're happy when they don't rush lobbies. Yeah. It's one of the things that... So now Trigger has just enough units to scare away the oracles. Like, obviously, if it's two stalkers, the two oracles are going to win. But outside of that... Oh, no, speaking of which... Oh, my God. That was almost two oracles. For sure. Yeah, and Zest, it, Zest is in the military chat, and sadly, he made, he probably had the longest run without being in the military for uh, folks of the Korean scene, if I'm not mistaken. Isn't that a, actually a thing? Yeah. He was that good. They didn't say Zest is the best for a reason. But that that said, we have uh, Dragon Phoenix Gaming's hero filling in for Zest. And he's been doing quite well at that. Yeah. Mm hmm it, Yeah, then he set the meta. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Ooh, are we going to see a debate onto the stasis ward? Oh, so unlucky for poor Trigger. It's a drop. Yeah. Oh, my God. We got Admiral Akbar stasis trap over here. Stasis ward. God. God. Yeah, it is looking pretty even, Stevens. For sure. Um, yeah. Yeah, the army side a little favor. The income has not... Yeah, it's not been on Trigger's side ever since the beginning of the game. Oops. 
We're all gonna lose an that Oracle finally. But it ain't over. He was the oldest one he entered the military. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. This is what Thorne's saying. You can always count on Thorne for stats. I'm sorry, but Thorne is... Seriously, like, it's very... It's something I've been impressed with ever hey, since I've known him in chat. Hey, speaking fuck? of Renegade, I have to announce this one. We I, I had some support here. Renegade, thanks for the raid. Hope you had a good stream. We were... This is Chicken Man and I, so a big hello to you. And a big shout out to Renegade. Yee. Yeah, this is... I mean, I do like that Trigger has a fourth going down, too. Definitely way better trades for Geralt. Uh, what are the upgrades? Geralt with the plus one advantage. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. That Stalker just made it up there with that proxy pylon just in time. Yeah, it's pylon still there. For, well, observers will clean it up. Damn, did you see that? Geralt even got the cancel, though. That's is it. yeah. He, he that looked like a very dead pylon, and he's just like, nope, I'm getting this. And a little bit of a base rate, a base race right here. But we had two immortals too with it. That was a strategic recall if there ever was one. Yeah. Yeah, that is pretty good. Uh, yeah, that said, he still has the army supply advantage, but at the same time, Jeral was late on the charge game, so funnily enough, he had those couple zealots derp there, and it's like, oh crap, I forgot to get charged a while back. I mean, he didn't just start it then, but you can tell he... He did... It seemed like he did forget something. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah. It... Yeah. Uh, one thing I will say, though, Trigger, though it's a little late, he's trying to reclaim his base. Uh, though a bold move, I wouldn't have hated him trying to cheek out a bottom left gold base uh, instead of retaking this. Uh, but... But Trigger's trying to buy time for Disruptors. He does have his second robotics facility coming with the Robo Bay finished up right now. Uh GG. Absolutely. Uh, I can't remember. I didn't see their... I think they just did the vetoes and DM, so... Um, curious to see. It might be... If, if maybe... If we get Stargazers, we know it's going to be a weird game. That's the one with the minerals blocking the, you can, yeah, that cheeky third potentially, or, yeah. I actually died to a Zerg 
oddly enough, where I missed, I scouted a little late where they did do the gas trick mine out, which is pretty embarrassing to die because it's like 30 minerals or something. Alex each... says, Streamer, what is your secret? You work with five minutes of sleep a week. I haven't seen you do cocaine, so <laughs> how do you barley. manage it? <laughs> Streamer, what is your secret? You work with five minutes of sleep. I haven't seen you do cocaine, so how do you manage it? Well, A moves. It's the answer. Alright, this time I think I'll get it spawning in the bottom left. Just so Chicken Man doesn't have to announce this guy again. <laughs> in the blue. Is he going to 3-0 and it is Geralt from Psystorm Gaming? <laughs> yeah, this is pretty wild stuff. Damn. Chicken man, maybe it's the luck of the draw, or I had just little enough sleep. I have a feeling I'll be able to go to bed before five in the morning, which would be fantastic. Like little things would be so helpful to getting me back to normalcy, and maybe I can return back to where I, I gotta reach that point where I'm actually looking forward to just getting anything resembling a normal sleep schedule in life again. <laughs> like to be honest with you. It's pretty, you know. Mm. Yeah, it, it exactly. Yeah, so if you, yeah, right. Exactly, like. I can say with this experience now too and how much I'd been streaming overall it's same you know you could relate even if, if you don't see people streaming like 24 hours a day they're spending time doing other things for their stream usually uh so it's like you like for Yeah. Oh, for sure. Yeah, I've... Yeah, exactly. I mean, it's for me... Surprisingly, I've put time into other stuff with the amount I've streamed over time, but like I would actually be doing working on my stream while streaming or on like lunch breaks. Literally, I'd be on lunch breaks or like if I was tied up in a meeting, I'd be on my phone like researching stuff so I can add it to my stream or do whatever. Yeah, that's how I've done it. But you know what? We're running the we're as I get back into things, we're entering the land of fuck it. Fuck it all, you know? Sponsor. Ooh, Fe uh, Phoenix versus Oracle. Yeah, for sure. I'm still... Yeah, just with the signups and stuff, it was a dice roll on who was going to check in. A lot of this stuff kind of went through what I expected. But either way, for who showed up, I'm actually... It is an interesting outcome to the finals. Not super surprising, but like we did have just a lot of heavy hitters today. Uh, not to... It really is. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. Yeah. For sure. I should have changed that up a bit, though. When I saw Trigger and Nina... I'm going to ask about that next, because that was... That's a good matchup, though, for the... For sure. It's a... Uh, get some value at the Phoenixes here, but they're going to be out of energy pretty shortly. I do like this proxy. Yeah, a few reinforcements coming up behind it. Phoenix is forced, but well, he actually debated them back a little bit. Now uh, they're dead even on supply, but some of that is in Phoenix's. Beautiful target flare from Trigger for a while. Yeah, he's out DPSing the battery, which is huge. But his... Yeah, it does save the day, but allows Trigger to take a third base behind this. That was huge. For the Triglodyte. I, I got that from Steadfast. That's actually fans of Trigger. I forgot what it was. He just, He's like, yeah, to be honest, I can't remember where that came from, but it was something for, like, the Trigger fan club. <laughs> the Triglodytes. Honestly, two Immortals from Draw said good call right now. Charge isn't done yet. Uh, he kind of knows there was some investment in that many Blink Stalkers, so... But it could be, uh, it's looking not good for draw overall. Let's be real here. Yeah, warp prism. GG's called. Uh, yeah, it's not worth it. It's getting late here in Poland. Yeah. Interestingly enough, Mr. Chicken Man, it is funny to be realizing that we're closer in time. You know, still, I, I'm forgetting, like, you know, just starting out with you is a weird feeling uh, with you being in Hawaii. And I'd often think you were three hours behind, and you reminded me, like, Dave, I'm like five hours behind. Which is actually kind of... I mean, it's cool. It's easier. Yeah, yeah. That two hours makes a nice difference. <laughs> For planning and... Yeah. 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 Mm hmm Yeah, for sure. Yeah. You can take him again, you know. And speaking of stars, he's got like some little sparkly stars in his uh, cute weeby emotes. Give it up for 
And Mr. Trigger. T Team Super. Looking like he's up to some shenanigans already. The back base. Ooh. Speaking of shenanigans. Woodhead, nice. I've caught a bunch, but I'm surprised out of Geralt. That's a that's the shocker for me. I don't know about you, Chicken Man. He, he's get, you got to read on Trigger going to take that back base and does the gas deal. Hmm. I think he's gonna want to go into adepts from how the setup's looking. Or a trigger. Yeah, it's more of a... Yeah, I mean, honestly, he's not going to do it. So he's got a quicker base too, but we haven't seen that. But truthfully, this would be the kind of game where I wouldn't hate it. The only problem is, is you have that defensive back base. Uh, but that said, you can just, you know, like 3-8 Robo, you historically do in 2 gay games even. You're just going for the extra pressure of the Immortal. But then we've seen nothing but Stargates. It's going to be another Stargate again. But the question is, will this be an over-series or not? Jeez, I really wish I uh, brewed up a little more coffee in the morning here. Yeah, I don't know why. Like, I just really am not going to lie. I think it had to do with the fact that I, I streamed a lot yesterday, too. I streamed a lot Friday, too. But I wasn't any casting. I actually did Raid Shadow Legends and, <clears throat> and, and threw away a lot of MMR because I was so tired. Over... Actually, I had cheese a lot yesterday over uh, EPT Asia. Like, I, I literally went past EPT Asia, even Chicken Man. <laughs> uh. Oh, nice, dude. Nice. Sorry. Yawn, I did. It's not the games, chat. It's not the games. Yeah, like honestly. You ain't lying. All right, double Oracle going out. There's shield batteries and stalkers defending in each location for... Mr. Trigger. Yeah, he certainly does because there's just a lot of defense here. He's gonna get a couple kills, but he doesn't want to lose the oracles. And guess what? Adapt's doing God's work. Trigger ain't going. Trigger's taking a note from Geralt this game. He's like, you know what? We're gonna use the the OP adepts this game. They're giving us a show. <laughs> okay, I think I'm a little more awake now. Yeah, that it was a nice soccer punch. Someone ruined my 10 channel point bet. I just saw that. I just chat. Oh, God. Too funny. What a banger of a series. Yeah, they both need some water. They mean business. You know what? Same times three. 
Totally not going to look for a cheeky caffeinated beverage quick. You're like, damn it. Yeah, you Oof. <laughs> Jello shot noise. <laughs> Be right back. In my chat, we have a lot in favor of Geralt, or had originally, but I don't see any predictions. I didn't run any. Sorry about that. I was muted and didn't realize it. The double mute. I actually am starting to remember to mute it on my interface. Though the thing with the Wave XLR, I will say, kind of like a Google Home or Alexa, you just tap the top of it to mute or not to mute, by the way. Yeah, it does have some neat features, or you press in the, and you press in the knob to change. It, it has some cool shit, truthfully. Yeah, just to, to hit the mute. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. All right, now, match point. Here we go. You want it? I, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> How I said that was. And his opponent in the bottom left, representing Team Super. Give it up for Trigger. In the yellow, he's coming back with the yellow. Is that his good or bad luck? Let's see if we got anything spicy out of these guys. We see if... Yeah. The first game, he was yellow, though. So, hmm. Hmm. We shall see. This has definitely been a banger of a series. All right, we're going to have to add some trigger triglodyte commands. In honor of Steadfast, considering how much time I've spent on Stead... You know what, Chicken Man? Your laps and stream... You were certainly... Uh, just from time, I had more in, in uh, Steadfast originally. But you know something? I racked up a shit ton of channel points in your channel. Where I, I was like, Chicken Man's probably going to be my uh, number one most watched stream. And you may still be, who knows? Even in that lapse of time. That's how much time I was in your channel. <laughs> and, uh... Oof. Yeah, I get a little probe harass. From a Geralt, who's quite good at it, but this time, Trigger was pretty good on defense against this probe, though. This probe is going to regain some shields, but that's... That's kind of close. Look at that micro from Trigger! Dove! Move! Yeah, all that work in micro from Geralt. 
And the Nexus still went up. It's going to be a close one as far as that goes, though. And again, another Stargate from Geralt. If I were Geralt, I don't know about you. He's had good luck. His best plays, I think, so far have been with the Adepts. But uh, we'll see. If he did an Oracle Adept again, he's not going to do that. <laughs> oh, boy. Chat really going at it over Trigger and Geralt. Hmm. And yeah. Dude, it's all right. I forget you like do that stuff at from time to time when we're in uh and it does not bother me i just uh I, you know same who getting a century that's a yeah evaporated all right so trigger getting blink way quicker than Geralt with going twilight before stargate but Geralt's gonna have his twilight in then just a few moments well, not. Eh, it's coming up here. I love how the uh, production doesn't always line up with things. Like, where it showed Warp Gate completing for me, but not the Twilight Council. I don't know. It's just. It, well, it never shows the buildings. I mean, okay, that's a sign. I'm tired. It's my first. It's my first day. All right, Kappa. I've never casted a game of StarCraft two in my life. Yeah, another clip. Yeah, I think I, I was extremely tired one time and uh, I got a good clip there too. I was like, people were bugging me to cast replays endlessly. So I'm like, all right. And finally I was like, all right, we're casting here. I think we're playing StarCraft 2. I don't know. It might be balloons. And then half the chat's like, what the fuck is balloons? I'm like, oh my god. I am really showing my age. Balloons was like a tower defense flash game. Yeah. Yup. <laughs> flash. Yeah, exactly. Flash, the new Oregon Trail. <laughs> Oh, man. You know, we should make it. We should make a uh, Oregon Trail Starcraft edition. Wait, what are these oracles? That's a interesting debate. Stasis Ward. Yeah, it's obviously for. Re I think he wants to get value at the oracles and then be like, oh, we're going to snipe an oracle and blink in and then surprise Stasis Ward. Oh, yeah, because look, he's setting up for another one. Ooh, one of the stasis boards was stripped. Okay, it's the snipe wars. Ooh, nice catches from Geralt. He's forcing some lost mining time getting... Six, eight. Fourteen. Yeah, he's... Yeah, and Geralt has... Oh, no, sorry. Trigger has plus one in charge in the way before Geralt... But Geralt's going for a Robo, so I'm wondering if he is going for... Eh, I doubt it. Oh! Stasis Ward paying off.
Oh, damn. Yeah, that's actually pretty, pretty good stuff. Okay, he's, oh, little Miss Blink here with, he's going to lose, oh, two of the stalkers. Yeah, he's going to get a lot of damage, but Jarelf's even got a fourth base behind this. So, I think he, you know, mitigating worker losses or not, this is base trade, Bill, and it's going way in favor of Geralt, who's going to clean up more warping locations. And... Mm hmm Yeah, he does, it, and he, he doesn't have... And he's uh, blocked them plus one, which is very rough. Yep. <laughs> Classic Davisms. Well, one good thing is, yeah, he's going Glaives. Uh, he needs to get this plus one up, but there's so many Zealots. Oh. It's looking at pretty go. Oh, shield battery finishes just in time. You're absolutely right. And the worker counts even. The fourth base is probably just going to be collateral damage at this point, Chicken Man. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was... Yeah, Geralt. Looks like he's gonna have a bit of a problem winning the game with the Shady Maneuver. <laughs> there we go. We got a cockism in there. Yeah. Yeah, he's got a cock block now. Oof. But still, what a what a play, what a playing, what a show. And he's still, uh, guys. Let's see where we're at in the match, Reno. Prize pool one eighty nine. We have more codes. Because if you do, we have sixteen remaining. It'll add a few dollar dues in, and uh, we're at one hundred eighty nine dollars. So that leaves uh, Geralt is going, or sorry, Trigger is going to be receiving 10452. Geralt is going to be receiving 4290, and the semifinalist is are at about 2050, 2060. So I don't know, 20 and change. So if we get some more in, it'll. Match Reno you know, takes some money out of, out of everybody and you do exchanges, so it'll at least even it out for him. Mm. 
Yeah. I think he's just getting tired. And sorry you couldn't make it, Chris Jenner. I hope Chris Yanner's not mad that he couldn't make it. He's like, Dave, I thought we were tight. I like, we'll try to, we do our best to try to get stuff planned out. Oh. You too. Thank you. I'm going to, well, I'm going to get, I have to get some stuff done here first, but I'm at least closer. I'll probably be on and, uh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, I'm going to go help a fellow Raid Shadow Legender uh, do any promotional stream who helped out because they actually knew the game. Killjoy. Uh, Masters Dark Boy. You know Killjoy, I think, right? I, th I think... 